Hello ladies and gentlemen. Hello. You are watching the Alexa and Daniel watch movies and then they talk about them right after they watch them channel. Can you go through this? We're still working on the uh, title. We don't really have a title. We have so many other things going on in our lives that this is just... So, we watched the Civil War where we learned about Abraham Lincoln and the slaves and how the Emancipation Proclamation was thinged. I'm just, thing. I'm just kidding. It was Captain America Civil War, which is the 555th installment of the Marvel's Avengers series, <laughs> which includes the 5,888th reiteration of Spider-Man. Someone's hating. I am. Well, no, I have some good stuff to say, too. Okay. Um, so, let's get down <laughs> to the nitty-gritty. Um, uh, well, what was your favorite things about the film? Like favorite that? things. Okay. Um, I, liked, uh, I liked the new characters. Well, the new people to me. Okay. Like uh, Black Panther Man. Okay. And, um, I mean... Jackie Robinson? I don't know. Oh, that, that's the guy? He's the guy who played Jackie Robinson. Oh. Well, and then I, um, I mean, like, Spider-Man's, like, I'm not crazy about the, like, the, spy, this, this new version of Spider-Man, but, like, the guy, like, his character, like, this kid kind of, kind of won me over in his little scene, so, uh -huh. like, I'm not too crazy about that, about just the fact that it's another, like, Spider-Man, but, like, I mean, I guess like this at least is... it, at least it's a different type of Spider-Man. Yeah, because she has a hot aunt. So. Well, well, that. But I'm talking more about like all the other Peter Parkers. They felt they felt older, and yeah. they felt they didn't feel like they were high school kids anymore. Are you? They really felt like they were like 20 year olds playing a high school kid. Yeah. Now this actually feels like a, a legitimate kid, like. And I like the I like the diversity that's brought in by them. Well, it's already pretty diverse because they got like African American people, but but this guy's like legit African. Like he's yeah. like he's like beyond. He's like, he's like what, what's the, what's that Beyonce song with the? I can't think of it right now. Okay. Where they? No. It, it was in the Super Bowl. Well, plus one. No. Um. It's like it's like another word for like assembly or something. Anyway, but it's yeah. Um, I cause okay, so I haven't I didn't watch Age of Age of Ultron, and I didn't watch like what Ant Man. So I was just like it's just kind of I was like I don't really know who these people are. I don't really know what's going on, and it's just it's a long it's a long movie. They just go like way. They put a lot of stuff in it, and yeah, I just can I can I no. say a few things? Yeah, okay. Dang. I had a lot. To, I had like oh, a no. lot of opinions. Okay. <laughs> First of all, <laughs> can I say that this was probably the very first comic book film that, as soon as I heard it announced, I was I was very pumped about it. Okay. Like I was ready for it. You know what I mean? Okay. And, and it was the first time that I actually, uh, actually decided to go I downloaded uh, all the Civil War comics. Oh. And I started you? reading them and everything. Wow. Yeah, when did I you know, have time for pretty, this? This was, this was they announced this like three years ago. Oh. So I started like three years ago <laughs> to read the Civil War <laughs> comics. like before we were going out. I guess. Anyway. <laughs> Yes. Lol. Yes. So I I started reading um, uh, the, the Civil War comics, even though I didn't realize at the time that there's so many of them. Oh my god! Like the Civil War story arc yeah. spanned across like hundreds. Yeah, of the different Civil comic War books. was a long time, and Abraham Lincoln okay, did okay. a lot. Okay. Yeah. 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 <laughs> anyway, so uh, they changed a lot um, as far as the reasons why they're the. The, all the heroes in the Marvel Universe are having a civil war. Um, and and I think that 
it still holds it still it still holds the theme of like political uh, controversy you know because it, it to me it's a fascinating story where people can still be fighting for the same cause they still like they still fight for the same or they're still on the same side basically but they have a divide in, a, in an opinion of course that's right. America exactly that's why we had the Civil War yes Days of Future Past because I, I, I was like really into that. I really wanted to see that story come to come to uh, come out of the big screen, and I really liked it. It, it, it uh, paid off for me really well. This year, I really liked. I, I was really into civil the Civil War film, and I think it it, it satisfied me to almost entirely what I was hoping. I think it was a really good film. I mean, I think so. One of the one of the themes that like came to mind, like as the movie started, was it's just like it, which is one that I've kind of been seeing in the superhero movies. It's like um, it's it's like these heroes aren't perfect, you know. Like everyone's like, oh, they have like these like amazing powers, but like they also cause like a but ton of destruction like they like they mess up a whole airport like poor airport now no one's gonna get into that you know but it's like like even that's kind of the same thing they brought up in like the back really an airport it was kind of like a hangar bay or something no it was an airport but like that's the same thing they br- like they bring up kind of in like batman and superman you know like yeah. Uh, acknowledging that like people died and like there's all this destruction to be held accountable. yeah and and that like there's I, I don't know it, it seems like there's that that's kind of the shift that like because for so long it seems like in in like these kind of hero stories it's just like idolizing this like semi like this super superhuman being but now it's like the 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 theme these days is like exposing their flaws and like adding some adding some depth that makes yeah. it all deep and I don't know right right it's not at all hero worship yeah that's 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 the way we're going with, the, with things these days I mean that that's kind of that's kind of how I guess that could be like a reflection on like society I guess because sure. nowadays it's like you know we see everything. We, we can see, like, all, like, numerous, like, a lot of aspects about people. Yeah, I mean, there's always two sides of the coin, I guess. So. So, who is, who is your favorite character? Um. In this film? I don't know. I like Black Panther Man. You like Black Panther Man? I like um, Mary Kay and Ashley's little sister. Is she in the other one? She is in. She, I should. I she want, was introduced in Age of Ultron. Okay. Well, I didn't. I was like, who's this chick? And then, and then, like the red. Eh, I don't know. I need. I don't like. See, I didn't watch it, so I'm like, I don't. I don't know what's yeah. going on. I'm like, does she have an accent? Is she faking it? Would did this she, accent come up early? Early? Like, I don't know. Yeah, she was from the. Uh, she was from the town that they kept talking about. It sounds like Slovakia, but it's not. Sokovia. Sokovia. She's from Sokovia. Okay. Well. Yeah. Anyway, um, my favorite character. I, I did like the the use of Ant Man. Uh, yeah. You know he. He's they really like, displayed his power as well. He's like PG Deadpool. Yeah. Um, even though it, it, they didn't really, it's such a long movie, and it's such a shame that they didn't really have time to to uh, explain. Uh, you know everyone's stake in the the Civil War story. Yeah. You know? So it was just a matter of, oh, we recruited this guy to help fight on our side. Eh, whatever. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay with that, man. Just, just I mean, and the, the, the thing, like, that's kind of what, it's kind of a similar thing to, like, the, like, Batman and Superman again. Like, they're supposed to kind of be on the same team, but then, like, they're, like, put against each other, sure. except, except all we got for theirs. I don't, like, that's all, that's all. That's kind of all I got to go off. I also like Bucky. Bucky's 
They're so, they're so cute. Yeah. I just like, I wish they could just have their own show. Yeah. That was so cute. My, my, my biggest criticism of the film <laughs> was the big reveal at the end and the guys, um, the guys, motiv- the bad guys' motivations. Yeah. Uh, spoilers from here on out if oh, you guys okay. have. Yeah. So, anyway, uh, this guy, basically, his whole motivation wasn't because he was a part of Hydra or anything. It, I don't think it was anymore. No. It was just because... It's personal. Yeah, it was just because he was either in uh, uh, Sokovia or in New York. I don't know which one. I think one. it was Probably the Russian Sokovia. one, yeah. Yeah. He was in Sokovia, and he and his family were far outside of the city just trying to watch what's go- you know the Avengers do their thing in Age of Ultron and their fam- his family was collateral damage yeah and that's that was so but that was kind of the theme you know like that lady collateral came up damage. like the lady came up to, to Tony Stark and was like Viola Davis she's like this this is a picture of my son like you killed him like yeah. feel bad yeah but uh, I don't know to me that was kind of, that was a, that was a weak reveal and all of a sudden, Captain America finds out that Bucky killed his parents. See? We go in the theme of you killed my, like, the par- the yeah, dead parents. Yeah. These, he- like, ugh, it's just, what? it's all the same. Was that enough for Captain America, I mean, sorry, uh, Tony Stark to just, to just go crazy and be like, you but, killed my parents, I'm going to kill the, it you, seems I'm like, going to kill Captain America. I don't think I really wow. watched that movie, but it seems like that's his personality, so... So I just I don't know I just feel like what what drew all the Avengers apart could have been stronger could have been like yeah because then they're like what there's like we should just the guys like we should, let's just get them all against each other that car parked the opposite way he's like let's just get them all against each other and he's like no they're stronger than that and it's like oh okay I mean I'm not complaining because it was really epic to see heroes versus heroes uh, if anybody yeah. watches wrestling I'm a big fan of like uh, face versus face uh, story arcs I, I think yeah. they work I wish they happened more often instead of the traditional baby face versus heel you know like uh, when John Cena wrestled Daniel Bryan both of them were baby faces okay. at the time and, it, and that was one of my favorite feuds in, uh, in recent years so <gasps> um, should we give a rating out of 10? Oh, right. You want to go first? I will... Gosh. I will give this movie a... Well, I don't... I didn't really know what was going on. And it was took <laughs> really long. But maybe because I was tired, too. Uh-huh. And it's been a long week. Um, but I mean, it was cool. I'll give it a. But you didn't love it. I mean, it's all it's all right. It's cool. Too many too many superheroes. I give it a. You turn this on. Or sure. Not? Go ahead. Ah, ah, ah. One. Okay. I give it a eight. 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 You know, if you watch most of our reviews. They're all in the eights. Most well, of them. <laughs> look, how, look how picky we are. <laughs> because it's like, are we, like, that's the thing. Like, am I basing my rating on ratings of other movies or just, like, how I, we, you know, like, this is, how this I is. feel right now. This What's is the number free, I feel like giving it tonight? This is free flowing, yeah. you know. We're not trying to get, like, viewers or, like, subscribers. Like, this is just for our leisure. Leisure. Yeah. Exactly. So, if we were, yeah. were trying to get viewers and subscribers, we'd use the light. I know. Or dark, we'd use a night vision. Anyway, yeah. I will give this film a 9.5. Wow! It's not perfect. You know, I did mark it down just because I think that the direction could have been a little bit more. Um, they could have even given it the, uh, the, the Breaking Dawn treatment and uh, just... You know, Civil What's War a Breaking pa- Dawn? Civil War Part 1, Civil War Part 2. Oh. Um, <laughs> I was like, 12? Deathly Hollows treatment, you know. Uh, 
They could have done that, but it's not a. You they could have, but don't they have like a bunch of other movies? And they got. A, they do. They have plenty. They have Spider Man. They do. I know, but again, I'm, I'm saying that this uh, Captain mm-hmm. Captain. Also, I uh, will say Captain America is my favorite Avenger, just because I like the fact that he doesn't really have any superpowers. He's fine as heck. Okay. I also like Arrow Man. He's fine. Falcon. You know, no, not that. No, no. Arrow man. Arrow. Jeremy Renner man. Oh. But honestly, Hawkeye. but honestly, like, I wish that I had, like, a Falcon in my life. Like, he's so, he's just like, I will stay by. Your wingman, by. literally. Yeah. <laughs> like, I, like, he's so loyal. I'm like, <laughs> it's like Brienne of Tarth loyal, you know, like. Mm. I don't care. Like I'm gonna be with. You. I'm gonna stay with you. Okay. I will say that it's almost an embarrassment of riches that Marvel has now, though. I think they have way too many big actors. That's um, true. Like they have a past. Uh, um, they have uh, Don Cheadle. Um, you know, as War Machine. I as as Iron Man, black and white. <laughs> Ebony and Ivory. Yeah, yeah, as War Machine, and and like, um, I guess I can understand why they take him out. That way, they don't have to use him that much in other movies. I'm sure Don Cheadle and uh, and um, Robert Downey Jr. are they're very expensive paychecks. That was so cash. weird in the beginning. Cash. I was like, this is a flashback or something, right? And then they like superimpose his face, and I was like, that was pretty cool. I was like, what it am I like, watching right now? It, like the eighties? Like the eighties, even it though was, it was nineteen ninety one. It was but tripping me it out. It looked like the eighties. It looked like Ferris. Well, Bueller. because yeah, because they have they know what he was acting back yeah, then. Anyway, yeah, so. yeah, it's true. Crazy. Um. Movies are crazy. Yeah, there's just so many big actors that they had that they crammed into this film. They didn't Can you have... imagine what it'll look like in the Infinity War movies that are coming out in a few years? It's gonna have these guys, and it's gonna have the Guardians of the Galaxy in them. It's gonna have Doctor Strange in it. It's gonna have the Black Panther in it. Uh, a few other new and guys. And then they they didn't have the Hulk. Spider Man. They'll <laughs> probably have a Hulk. And they didn't have um Thor and Loki. Thor and Loki probably have them too. Uh, this is a little much. Yeah, it's a lot. It's it's and a lot. Where are the girls? All we got is we got is Russian well, Russian they, Spider and Russian. There's a, uh, mind control. Check. I don't know. Maybe they're gonna have Jessica Jones up in there by the time Infinity War comes out. Mar- it's, it's it's a lot. That's a, it is a lot. See, There's it's, it's an embarrassment things. of riches, and it's a lot. It is. I can't even. I'm I'm not complaining, but at the same time, I wish that. I can't even. I'm tired. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. It's too this many. Is this is going wrong. This is going wrong. Too many. I just want to say that I, I love you all. I'm looking forward to I'm proud of you. what what's what's happening in the future. Although the only I really like I really want to see Doctor Strange. It's just the only Marvel movie that I'm just that has my attention and interest as much as this one did in the future. Now is probably Guardians of the Galaxy two. Because Chris Pratt's in it and he's beautiful. Sure, I am looking forward to Age of Apocalypse though. Age of Apocalypse. No, just X Men Apocalypse. We're, one, we're trying to wonder how old the apocalypse is. X Men <laughs> Apocalypse. <coughs> That's the next one. All right. So, uh, oh, and Star Trek Beyond. Yay! I love year. movies so much. If you did. You would have seen Age of Ultron. I. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. I love you. Happy birthday. Be good. Don't uh, don't do drugs. Stay in school. Okay. No. Yeah.